Hello everyone, Lars here. Welcome back to some more Black Desert Online. And yeah, there is some nice things to know in this game, and that's daily quests. Uh, if you know about contribution points, you know that you need those to farm and stuff. Uh, we're going to talk about that in another video, I guess. And you have some daily quests, some small daily quests. And we have Weehaul here. They're scattered all around. I can show you a couple. Um, and if you go to quest, lost we hole, blah blah blah, and you get 100 contribution experience from this and uh, recover some energy, so th that's pretty pretty awesome. And this quest uh, you can take every day after 2400 hours, or what is that, uh, 12 pm? Yeah, uh, right after midnight, one second after midnight, uh, this resets, so you can take that every day. You have to activate this bring to Laura and continue. And like that, and now we all will follow us. So let's just go deliver that. One thing to remember about those uh, thingies running after us. They won't uh, run as fast as the maximum sprint on the horse. So you should just go like this basically. Basically like that. Let's see we all is after us and that was... What the heck is happening now? <laughs> okay, that was a huge derp. Yeah. The UI thing is really, really irritating though. I really don't like that. So, let's go walk with the horse because the horse doesn't want to run a lot. Um, yeah, even these icons got smaller. Okay. Well, here we are at Lara. Do you know we hold? Blah, blah, blah. Continue. Next, and we get contribution experience. And that is so awesome. You can get, um, I think I get about two levels each day from the contribution points. Or from the two levels of uh, contribution experience. Or two points each day because of the daily quests. And that is pretty, pretty awesome. Yes, it is. And I want to show you... Another one, that's nice. The horse can just park there. Uh, this one is in Heidel. They have daily quests in uh, every city and uh, sometimes around some nodes. So just activate that quest, snapped kite. This dude is not cool, he lost his kite. And <laughs> it's so simple. It's just activate it, run to Lara. Activate it, run here, quest objective, kite, and uh, completed, and we have to just go back and talk to him again. Uh, it's so awesome, it's really, really nice. It's, yeah, after I found out this, my contribution points just skyrocketed, because I didn't have to take a lot of other quests. Now let's see, talk to him, next, choose concentrated herbal juice, uh, complete, and that's that, and we haven't got another level yet, but I can show you a couple of other ones. Yeah, these bothersome rabbits, this is also a daily quest, and that's from, in the town square here, I think it's this guy, the furniture dealer, he has a quest, uh, because I don't like the... Yeah, we have to do this every time. Uh, they bother some rabbits are annoying me all the time, so... <laughs> uh, we have to... We can take that, that's like 80 contribution points. This guy has a daily quest, timber delivery, blah blah blah. Oh yeah, this is just recover um, energy and stamina experience. But that's also nice if you... If you do crap and you do stuff that you need a lot of energy for, you can do that. And let's see, we need to take this stupid wheelbarrow. And yeah, like this. I remember you don't hold in the uh, buttons, you have to click them. And just be careful and not click them like mad. I did that a couple of times. And then the stupid wheelbarrow will will just fall over and uh, <laughs> the animations to pick it up again it takes a little while it's really annoying so like this stop 
Uh, yep, you can't drop it because before you stop. And brought a card full of wood, blah blah blah, choose this, complete. And yeah, that's basically it. Um, we can run to another one, I guess. Run and check it. A lot of nice sunflowers there. Where's our horse? There he is, Raupe. I always think this is, this is a girl. Yes, I do. I really want to... I really want uh, this horse to be a girl horse. Uh, you got one up here too. No, that tree stump. Uh, to bring a wheelbarrow. Uh, that's... I don't remember if you get contribution points for that, but... You know, it's uh, good to know about. So, yeah, that's basically it about daily quests. I'm going to just show you a couple. Just to have done that. Yes, yes, yes. I really hope the quality of these videos will get better. You, of course, you see exactly what happens and you don't miss anything. It's not, it's not a problem like that with the graphics. The problem is that it... It should look as beautiful as possible, of course, because that's... Yeah, like when I watch videos on YouTube, I I want it to look good. Even though I uh, uh, get everything that happens and stuff, it's, it's nice to have nice graphics, of course, because nice graphics are nice. And here we have a daily quest with... Mm, this soldier, I guess. Yep. Blah, blah, blah. He does not like goats. And I didn't pay attention to the contribution points there. Uh, but no worries. I mean, <laughs> it's so insanely easy. Uh, we just run up here. Kill a few goats. Boom, boom, boom. Two ghosts. Quest <laughs> objective accomplished. Uh, it's so incredibly nice. And it just takes like 50 minutes or so to complete this quest. And yeah, 50 contribution points. Let's take a mana potion, because why not? Uh, go out of combat, because no point going in combat. And yeah, running up some stairs and stuff is a little bit annoying sometimes. Quest, fix the barricades. He has to fix them every day, because it's reasons. I don't know why the heck that is. And uh, this is... 80 contribution points. We have the axe already. So let's just jump down here, chop a tree, cross our fingers that we will get regular logs. Yes, yes, yes. Come on, come on. Yeah, I should have put some stuff in my inventory actually. Or my uh, storage in the town. Okay, just one log. That's annoying. I have to. Oh, somebody already looted this. Probably to get the same quest as us. Uh, I see, find another tree. Come on, trees. This is a tree. Yep. There we go. And let's just chop trees, which is really, really boring. Very, very, very boring indeed. And as you might see, the uh, some of the UI stuff, um, it's a little bit pixelated. because, uh, And that's... The same on my screen. Uh, that's because I uh, scaled it a little bit longer. Oh, completely full. Yeah, we can't get that quest without dropping some stuff. I think we have to drop more stuff. Yeah, give log. Continue. Oh no, no empty slot. Come on, we just dropped the thing. What's this contribution point? We don't want to throw that here. Uh, oh, we have some of these. Okay, that's nice. Let's see, what can we drop, actually? Yeah, let's drop the weed flower, because we don't need that much. Uh, yeah, let's talk to him again. Give log, continue. Yeah, and as you can see, we had to have a couple of slots open in our inventory, even though we didn't get anything. That's stupid. And yeah, we still haven't gotten... One extra, but that's fine. And we have to run to Velia to complete that. Yes, yes, yes. Go, go, go. Ride faster. Yeah, it would be nice to have like a Superman skip. Wait, what? Was that a ninja? 
No, that was a ninja that just stood in the road. Okay, that's funny. That's funny. And my brother wondered why I always go to the right <laughs> when I run here. That was a little bit funny. Why don't you go to the left, he said. <laughs> no, I like the right way because I always go the same way. It's like a habit. Isn't it called a force of habit or something when you just have to do it? Even though you know it's not necessary or something like that. Yeah, I don't know. It's, I think it's called force of habit. But yeah, whatever. We are in Velia. I'm going to show you another really, really easy daily quest. Mariano, a little girl that lost her cat. Cat on the roof. Next, next, next. Uh, that's 50. Contribution experience. And the cat is just right here. Uh, it's just right here. And the cool thing is that, uh, or the one good thing is that, of course, you have to run a little bit, but you actually get uh, get uh, experience on your horse too. So it's no reason not to take it actually. And uh, let's see, yeah, I'm soon at the next level. And it's a couple of more daily quests that I usually take. Uh, it is some. Um, Daily quests in um, there is some daily quests in Olvia, but that's <laughs> that's really far, so you probably don't want to go there unless you want experience on your horse and stuff. But there are a few daily quests there that you get a lot of experience points. I think there's someone at the Western Guard camp, and in Heidel, um, you have a guy right here. I think that uh, wants you to kill the, uh, you know, the swamp dudes, the frog dudes. I think they're in somewhere around here. Yeah, Fogan, fortune teller, flamingo. Yeah, the Fogans, the frog dudes. You have to kill some Fogans, and you just get some experience from that, and it's okay. It's fine to do. Yes, it is. So there you have it, you have a few daily quests where you can get a lot of contribution points and it just takes like, I don't know, 15, 20 minutes. It's really nice, it's very very nice. So now you know that, uh, good thing to know, you probably have daily quests in all the cities, like in uh, like in Gilch, the crappy town. Oh, I got some stuff in here, okay. So yeah, be, uh, pay a little attention to that if you want to have a lot of contribution points and get your farming and stuff up and going. That's really important. Um, oh yeah, let's see. I'm going to park here because I'm going to talk about some stuff in the next part. So this is good. Yeah, and that's that. I hope you had fun and I will see you next time.